What is going on today guys? We are here for another episode of Gold Rush the Game Leaderboard Event. Now, I'm very excited for this episode for a few different reasons. And the first being, you know, look at our progress so far. We're sitting at 565 ounces of gold at the moment. But the main reason I'm excited for this is this could very well be our last clean out on this claim before we jump claim. So, super freaking excited about that. Uh, it's going to depend on how this gold goes. So if we get some really good stuff out of this, then we'll be moving. Um, I did do a bit, a lot off camera rather. Um, I actually ended up going and renting the drill and doing a little bit of drilling to see where the gold was. Now the main gold was basically all this front area was all just so holy magnetite. Okay, yeah. As you can see... The, the front here was basically our big hot spot. So, now the one problem that we had was, or rather that I had, um, was when I, I did the drilling, paused the game, had to go do something with the power, and I hit the wrong breaker. Shut off my damn computer, and I, so I didn't get a chance to save it. But I knew where this front, front good gold was after drilling, so... We ended up hitting it with the excavator pretty good. The end loader wa was doing really good, but the bottom gold in the pits was not nearly as good as I wanted. So I sent the end loader back that same night, actually. Wow, look at that magnetite. Yeah, this is going to be... This might very well be our best clean out yet, but I am I am hoping, hoping to God that we have have enough to get on to the uh, to the next claim because I am super ready to get to get going on to the next one so ready for it um, it's not that this claim is bad or anything but I want to be seeing some like huge freaking gold numbers huge like I'm talking massive numbers um, we do have a full bucket of magnetite already in the truck so yeah we got tons of magnetite we're ready to do ourselves an upgrade or two you know it depends on what we pick but let's get this out of here that's another full bucket ready to ready to go so god I'm so excited to get on to the next claim can't wait now the plan with the next claim is is we're gonna we're gonna lease it and I'm gonna rent the rent the drill right away so our next episode is going to be all about drilling that's all we're going to do is have an episode where we just drill the claim find where the gold is and then i'm going to get everything set up on there off camera because it's going to be a lot of work get all this set up getting everything transferred over hooked back up so that's going to be basically a lot of downtime where i'm just you know doing my thing hauling stuff back and forth and getting everything all set up and ready to go for some more mining now the one nice thing about the next claim is going to be the gold numbers once we actually get back to mining after we get our drilling and get all set up on there we're we should be seeing some pretty impressive gold numbers we really should so i absolutely cannot wait for that it's you know, it's we're due some some serious numbers of gold. Get us streaking up the leaderboard, and you know, whole bunch of stuff like that. Another thing I want to do once we get on to the next claim is I kind of want to change up how I'm doing my cleanouts a little bit. I want to get a bunch more mats. So the reason for that is is in between like my digging and stuff you know after you after you fill up your mats you gotta you gotta wash them every time well I want to just save up like a stock of mats and then you know once we get like our stockpile of mats we can do like a huge huge wash with the nuggetator at once because that's it takes quite a while to do the mats and you know when I'm in when I'm in the mode for we're actually digging I'd like to just keep keep just plugging along doing that, and, you know. And like I said, 
have one huge clean out at the end of all the mats and stuff. Man, that thunder is loud. I apologize for that. Uh, first day of autumn, so we're greeted by some thunderstorms. But that's okay. Uh, summer's finally over. That's another another really exciting thing about moving on to the next claim is we should not need the water tower. You know what? Let me adjust this audio because I have a feeling that you guys are like not going to be able to hear me. Let's try that. There we go. Hopefully that's a little better. I didn't even think about that, but I just looked up at my uh, uh, my little bar on the screen for my recording software, and I could see that the, the game sound was a bit louder than my voice, so don't want to... Um, don't want you guys to not be able to hear me. I want you guys to hear what I'm talking about over the over the thunderstorm. So figured I'd turn that down real quick. But yeah, I'm, I'm so excited because, like I said, we won't have to spend the money on getting a water tower. So you know that's 150,000 plus filling it gone off of what we're you know what we're gonna need to move. So that's gonna be a huge help. And by by looks of these gold numbers, I think we're I think we're going to be just fine for moving on to the next claim, to be perfectly honest. Um, I don't remember the price tag for the lease. I think it's 800000 We are going to move straight to, to Nighthawk, or I think I said that right. I believe it's Nighthawk. I have, such, I have such issues trying to remember what the hell the claims are called. But I'm pretty sure it's Nighthawk. Um might be wrong I think I'm right but yeah I'm pretty sure it's Nighthawk but anyway we got a couple extra workers nothing special most of which you know I think we have like two or three now that are duplicates already it's like that's that's a little bit a little bit irritating but you know we're getting there we actually upgraded one of the workers I was gonna show it on camera but it is just a is just the one for the hog pan so it's like you know, all you do is you go in there, and I'll show you. We got another one that's going to be ready, like, here very shortly. But I just did that quick when I went to check, uh, check one of the, one of the workers that applied. And, you know, I, to be honest, I really wasn't even thinking about it at the time, about showing it on camera. So I apologize for that if you guys are going to be a little upset about me doing that. But, you know, I was basically trying to make this huge push this weekend. To get this done, and right now it's it's late late Sunday night already. I didn't get nearly as much done this weekend as I wanted, uh, courtesy of not feeling the best. So, you know, it is what it is. Not a whole lot we can, not a whole lot you can do about that. When you feel like crap, you just feel like crap. So, wow, that is a weird hue to the sky after that storm cleared out. But another thing, uh, I did not mention this before. I had talked to you guys on camera about what what was happening with like my doctor's appointments and stuff like that. Um, well, all the results come back negative on that. And I got to talk to my doctor after she come back from her two-week vacation. And so she finally, she finally agreed with me that I was right. She needed to treat me the way I told her. And so we're moving forward with that. Now, the thing with that is, one, the meds are expensive, and two, it's a specific diet. I'm on a very, very specific diet for this, so it's it's a little interesting there. But the meds, oh my god, the meds for my two-week course of meds, it's $1,641. Yes, that's right, $1,641. And forty-one dollars. It is very expensive, <laughs> and the reason I mentioned that is, uh, I was planning on doing something for our hundred subscriber special, which should be coming up pretty soon. And I want to thank you guys so much for that. You guys have been absolutely 
legends in that category. Uh, thank you guys all so much for all your subs. I really appreciate it. I really pre appreciate you guys supporting the channel like that. Uh, but for my 100 subscriber special, I was going to do something. But unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to now. Um, so I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do for that. But... Uh, I'll have to I'll have to figure that out now. Maybe what we end up doing is just uh, put it on hold for the moment because I really would like to do what I was thinking. I really I really would. Um, so, but unfortunately, like I said, plans didn't work out that way. These meds are expensive. They're gonna. I've had them before. I had them earlier, but when I had them last time, she didn't quite listen to me enough about what was going on with it so otherwise i probably would have been probably would have been better if if you'd uh paid more attention to what i was saying the last time i was on them but yeah they're very expensive they are they really kill my stomach taking them but it's a it's a targeted antibiotic specifically for this so you know hopefully it does the trick this time I actually come up with my own diet for it. I was talking to her about a specific diet, and she really had no idea what the hell I was talking about, which kind of surprised me because, you know, uh, and this this actually kind of kind of triggered me a little bit when she said she had didn't really know, and she was just gonna refer me to a dietitian for it. And I was like, um, no, I'll. I'll make my own diet then, I guess. But shouldn't, shouldn't you know more about this than I do? You know, kind of, kind of triggered me a bit. But anyway, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bitch about that. Let's see what we got for magnetite out of all these cleanups. We're at 23%. So let's see this number just go flying up. Look at that, 12,981 ounces of magnetite. Holy crap! So. Let's head to the blacksmith and let's see what we can get with all this magnetite. Alright guys, so here we are. Let's go check out, see what we can do for upgrades here. So, I'm curious to know, can we get this one? Oh, come on. 300 ounces short. Man, what a kick in the balls. What a kick in the balls there. 300 ounces short. That's... That's disappointing, but... Yeah, we can get a couple other upgrades here done. Actually, you know what? Let's hang on to the rest, and then I want to get that next. I don't care about the time upgrade. I don't care about the size upgrade. I want the gold losses one done next. So, we need to save, we'll say, the 77 ounces out. So, we got a lot of bars to smelt down. A lot of gold in our bank right now. So, yeah, this is going to be great. This is going to be a hell of a payout for us. Um, the only question is, is it going to be enough to get us to the next claim? Th there's no reason it shouldn't be. There really isn't. I mean, unless the price of gold took a ginormous shit, there's no reason that we don't have enough now. Because that 700 ounces, if it's, if it's even a remotely decent price, we should have plenty. If it's not, I can do a quick clean out tonight while the video, this video is going to upload. I'm going to put this video up tonight, so it's going to be a, at a really, really goofy ass time. It's probably going to come up about midnight, give or take. But the reason for that is tomorrow I want to, uh, I want to get, I want to get uh, the the drilling episode and probably our first clean out video done, if I can. And I want to get them all right away tomorrow. So I don't want to plague you guys with like a triple triple episode tomorrow. Because that might be a little bit excessive. But that's why I'm going to be forcing this one out tonight yet. So I don't, I'm not sure exactly what time it is. But as soon as this is all done. And well if we have enough money that is. If we have enough money to move on to the next claim. As soon as this episode's done. I'm going to get this edited edited and rendered and all that sort of fun stuff and get it ready to go so 
All right, let's see. We need to save. I said like the 77. So we can, let's see. We can do like what? 160-ish? Good enough. 77.694 left in the bank. God, I'm so, I'm so excited to see how much this is going to give us for cash wise. Take a quick check of the leaderboard here. Going to load in here in just a moment. And there we are. We're at 8th and we're very close behind, you know, the top 6. And then from there it goes up a little bit. But I think, especially once we get on to the next claim here, our numbers should start flying up. I mean, I'm not exactly sure what to expect for gold per cleanup. But I have, you know, I have seriously high expectations for it. Seriously high expectations. So let's get on to the bank now and let, you know, let's see what we make for cash. Cause this, like I said, this ought to be one hell of a payout for sure. But then there's going to be a lot of work getting the next claim set up. So it's going to be, it's going to definitely be a quick minute before we're ready to go for the, for mining again. But I do want to get, whoops, ah, screw it. Just leave it running. Uh, I do want to get the mining done immediately. That's the first step. So, what's stock at? Oh, stock is at a nice price. Look at that cash right there. We're at 166 now. This should bring us up to right around a mil. Just shy of a million. Holy crap. All right. 800,000 to lease this puppy. Let's do it. $183,000 left. So let's take a look here on the map. And I forget where the hell this claim is. I forget how to get out to it too. Um, so we got to go past the gas station and up and around. Okay. That shouldn't be too bad. Yeah. So there's going to be our parcel. Um, I will get the drill rented. And you know what? Let's actually do that quick. Let's actually do that for this episode. Yeah, we have plenty of time. There's no reason we can't go find this claim together. Let's get this drill rented. And let's head on out there and take a look. Like I said, next episode is going to be all about the drilling. Whoops. Hit the brake, kid. Yeah. All right. So the drill, the drill is on sale right now. I would buy it, but I want to save the money just, you know, on the off chance that for some stupid reason we have a ton of breakouts come, breakouts, breakdowns come up when we get our plant set up. Um, honestly, we have not had a breakdown, and I don't even know how long, to be perfectly honest. So. Yeah, it's been quite a while. Um, got that set up out there. Let's let's whoops. Let's boogie on out there and check it out. Now I will drive out there with you guys this first time. Uh, be fair warned, there will be loading screens on the way out there. It you know again, it's because unfortunately I need to get a bigger SSD for my computer, and so the loading screens are a bit rough with this loading off of a base basic hard drive just so you guys know um, where the hell does that road go I don't even show up on the map so we gotta go out past the hotel I believe that marker is you can see right here that's where we'll end our season by the way so we're gonna go out past there we're gonna hang a right and it's kind of like a snakish trail up and through so Bear with me while we get out there. Like I said, it's... To be honest, I don't know the last time I was even out here. So, I'm going to be I'm gonna be looking at the map. It's been a while. Um, but, you know, let's go get lost together, shall we? So... Yep, this is where we'll end our season, and this is where we start the game right here. So you'll come here for the winter sleep hibernate the winter I'm gonna call it and then you come back and get back to it so this should be our road yeah 
I believe so. Yep. This is our road. Ooh, nice bridge. You know, the one thing that I think about on this game, you know, when we're when I'm playing it is fishing. I look at look at a nice river like this and go, man, I wish I could uh wish I could go there and take my fishing rod out and cast. I love fishing. Summer fishing, love it. Not a huge fan of ice fishing. I don't like freezing. I don't like being cold. Um and I know it's kind of dumb. I live in Wisconsin and I don't like being cold. You know. But I don't I still don't like it. What is this? Four fingers sawmill. Cool. Interesting. All right. So this is our trail, I believe. Yeah, that's pretty neat up through here. I think we go this way. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Okay. Um, let's look at the map. Where are we at here? So we need to, yeah, stay on the main road. And then... That must be where... Okay, we'll have to check that out once we get up here, but... So, three water sources. Hmm, that's interesting. And that would be our water... No, that's our selling area. They don't show you the water tower on the map. Wash plant area. Okay, so that's where we're going to set up our wash plant. Okay. Sure, let's just keep going and... And we'll take a look once we get up here more. Said, I don't remember the last time I was up here, so forgive me for having to look at stuff and everything like that. I've just been forever. Okay, yeah, this is this is neat. This is very cool. Um, yeah, I think let's go to right here. Oh, come on. Just lead me down onto the dirt. I want to get down like onto the dirt here and check this, check this place out. All right, so it looks like we have one hell of an area for mining. Uh, not exactly. I have no idea how deep this is. I cannot remember. Yeah, I just yeah. It's been too long, so I'm not even gonna try to try to guess how deep it is but looks like this is our first water source here looks like a big pond basically and there will be our water tower so it'd be easy to fill from right there we could just pop down a generator and go to town there so this is going to be our wash plant setup by the looks of it interesting looking setup a little bit different than you know, it's kind of a little bit different from how it's set up on the other place, but more or less it's the same basic concept. So, just like I said, it's slightly different. Uh, it won't be it won't be a huge huge change, but all right. And we got up here the selling and the buying area, and unfortunately we can't use those tanks or any of that old equipment there. But you know. Yeah, this place looks neat as hell. It's going to be a lot of work getting everything transferred up here, but all in all, I am happy as hell to be here. So, yeah, let's just park here. Break, please. Let's get out and check this out. This will be our storage unit. Um, we can put, like, extra parts and stuff in here and, like, our equipment stuff. But we got our tent over here, and yeah, this claim lo this claim looks pretty pretty big. Um, okay, so that finally brings up the water tower there. So yeah, we're gonna have a lot of area to mine. Um, let's actually just take a look at the parcel on the gold map here, and this isn't the right one. This is. So as you can see. 
there is a lot to this parcel here a lot so it's going to be it's going to be very interesting to see where the good gold is and how deep exactly it is cuz you can't really tell from this you know you can see like ridges and like a a little bit deeper spot there but it ought to be really freaking interesting to see how this goes here and this is another dig spot up here my guess is this would be for like I don't even know this doesn't look like it's a hog pan area why is this mineable dirt I don't think you can even get up in here with any equipment by the looks of it oh wait no no you can't hmm. oh, it is a hog pan area okay that that does make sense now now no never mind <laughs> I was gonna say you know it'd be interesting to see what we get from using the hog pan here but yeah that's not something we're gonna be doing on camera for the leaderboard event that's for sure that'll be something in our off-camera playthrough when we do get here you know just to kind of check it out just for you know curiosity sake I'll say so yeah this is our new claim guys we will be drilling this in the next episode we're gonna be we're gonna be spot drilling and when we find like a hot spot we're gonna drill around it so hope you guys are enjoying this content I hope you guys are as excited as it uh, excited as I am to get on this claim and get to hammering it out uh, I will get everything set up here looks like it should be fun to set this stuff up but once it's up and running, I think we should be we should be good to go. So Yeah. Doesn't look like it's too too bad of a setup here. So Yeah, will be interesting to see though. Um It's gonna take me quite a while to get everything over here, everything set up. And like I said, drilling is first. Drilling is happening the very next episode and we're just going to drill until we're we're basically going to drill the whole claim and then I'm going to start setting up. So it's going to be a couple a uh, couple videos without without mining. Well, no, actually it's only going to be one video without mining. Excuse me. But it's probably going to be a few in-game days of me getting set up and us drilling. So yeah, that's just a look at the future ahead. So I hope you guys are enjoying the content. I really do. And like I said, I hope you guys are excited as I am to get on here and start hammering up the leaderboard so yeah that's what we got to look forward to here coming soon so thank you guys so much for being here i do appreciate it i really appreciate all you guys subs and support for the channel so thank you guys so much for that if you guys are enjoying it make sure you guys show the love smash the like button for me comment down below what's your thoughts what's your thoughts on me jumping to this claim and let me know if you guys are as excited as i am in the comment section below and as always guys if you're new to the channel or even if you've been here a while as long as you guys are enjoying the content make sure you hit that subscribe button for me and trigger those notification bells that way you guys know as soon as i post up my new videos so thank you guys so much for being here i really do appreciate it and we will catch you guys for the drilling episode next